In the third part of placing down grills, we're going to show you how to place a grill at the end of an existing piece of ductwork. Practicat allows for grills, their necks, to snap to the end of ductwork. For example, imagine we'd like to use a sidewall grill that we would like to report later. We can come into the architectural bin, and here you can see we've designed a sidewall grill. It's a catalog of a simple rec neck grill. What we're going to do is we're going to click on this and we're just going to come over to the ductwork and snap to the end point just like we would attach two pieces of duct. You can see here that the duct is actually 36 by 24 in dimensions and therefore the neck width and length of this sidewall grill, as we're calling it in this tutorial, is 36 by 24. Now if you would like to have a flange or the grill's face to be larger than the duct by a specific distance, there are special parameters that have been added to the property box to make this easy. Those parameters are called width and length delta. We're going to double click on the grill and we're going to look in the geometry parameters and you're going to see that we have length delta and width delta. What length delta does is whatever value you give here. Practicat is going to add that value to whatever the neck length is and adjust the face accordingly. 40 is the length of the face of the grill. Neck length is the length of the neck length. And length delta is the difference between the two. So if we wanted to have a one inch flange all the way around the face of the grill, we'd actually want two inches of delta. So we'd put in for length delta, we put in two. And once we hit enter, Practicat is going to take two, add it to the neck length, and adjust the length. So the length should adjust to 38 once we've done this. So currently we hit two and adjusted it to 38. And if we'd like to do the same thing for the width, width delta is simply the difference between the width of the face and the neck width. So right now you can see it's 14, but if we change it to 2, Practicat will take 2, add it to the neck width of 24, and it'll adjust the width to 26. So we're going to hit 2, enter. And you can see that it's now adjusted the face. So this is a quick and easy way to get a flange or the face of the grill to be slightly larger than the duct you're attaching to. So to do that once again, we're going to grab a sidewall grill from our catalog or just any rec neck grill, we're just using this one as a sidewall. We're going to snap once onto the drawing, double click on the fitting, go to the AutoCAD property box and give the length delta, width delta, whatever you want. If we want a two inch flange all the way around, we'd actually type in four and four. That would mean that we've got two inches on each side or four inches of total delta. So here you can see the neck length is 36 and the face is 40, and the neck width is 24 inches, and the face width is 28 inches. So that makes it very easy to get the property set to exactly what we want. That'll conclude the tutorial on using grills as sidewalls and attaching it to the end of duct.